So when can a taxpayer make the claim? Some of the easy eligibility requirements. You have to be a single parent living on your own in a, in a domestic establishment. Generally, the child has to be under 19 years of age or older, uh, or older if, uh, if they have a disability. You supported the qualified dependent in your home. The child lives with you most of the year. Uh, you're in no less than a shared arrangement if there is a child support obligation by one of the parents. You can only claim one child. So this used to be called the equivalent to spouse credit. If you separate in the year, you're living physically separate, you can still uh, claim the spouse amount in, in the year of, of physical separation. So you can you can claim the spouse or a child if, if the eligible dependent credit applies. Now, you can only make the claim if you are not making child support payments for the child. Unless you are in a shared arrangement, then there's a special exception that applies. If I'm the primary parent, Chris, and you have, let's say the kids just on the weekends, so you're just like the access or visiting parent, and you pay me child support, you can't claim a child for the eligible dependent because you pay child support. Now, it would never happen, but if I was the primary parent and you didn't pay child support and you had the children part of the time, you could claim the eligible dependent. But there's very rarely a situation where the other parent is primary and you don't pay child support. Almost always, there's a primary parent, the other parent is paying child support and wouldn't be eligible to claim the eligible dependent. 